sons tell me who the richest guy <laughs> <laughs> Hello, everybody. It's Andrea DiPaolo from Valley Digital Services, and I'm here with Ralph Fajak today, a little bit of a mix-up. Um, we are letting our uh, fearless leader, Dennis Schiraldi, um, have the day off today. It's actually his birthday. His birthday. Yes. Finally, so he's finally legal. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> This they food. keep bringing food up oh um, as we're on here, so uh, please excuse us. Yeah, we uh, <laughs> tend smells to really beer good. over here and check out all the yummy <laughs> food there. Yes. Um, so make sure you give um, Dennis a shout out today um, for his birthday. So I'm taking over. We kind of hijacked this whole thing, and, and we're at Gia's today, um, and we're going to talk with them in a little bit. Um, they were gracious to um, help us out with the latest Instagram contest that we did. Right. Um, so we're here. We're here right at lunchtime. If you are at hungry. their old their old place, yes. not their new yes. place yet. Because yeah, yeah. we're talking about yeah. their their new developments that they have. Um, anybody who's unaware, they're actually moving to a bigger location, which we're really excited about, and they're yeah. really excited about. Um, so yeah, we're here during lunchtime. If you're hungry, come grab a bite. Yeah, not, none of our hi. stuff. Though. None of our stuff. <laughs> you yeah. can't touch ours. Can't, can't touch ours. Spread here. Wait, um, this is like when I was younger, we used to put our finger in everything so nobody can touch this yeah, stuff. Or lick it, <laughs> yeah, or lick it. Yeah, or yeah, something like that. that. Yeah, um, spit in there too. <laughs> so Ralph, um, we're gonna talk briefly, and then we're gonna bring in um, our, our Gia's friends. Um, well, so the nice thing is we couldn't go to their new place because Frank. The, the you know uh, the owner of uh, Gia said we needed to wear hard hats. Yeah. So he couldn't yeah. find one big enough for my head. <laughs> so he put a trash can on me and he said that's not uh, OSHA approved. That's not. Yeah, that's yeah. That's, that's not, not approved. Up to code. No, not um, up to code. Yeah, we're excited to see it though. It should be a few weeks. Yeah. Um, we don't know the exact date yet. Um, we'll let the Frank and Lynn speak to that. You know the nice thing, the funny thing is, I was at you know and it, it's over there by Blue Wolf and by, by One Hot Cookie and the old yeah. Chad Anthony's. Um, but I was coming out after dinner one night from the Blue Wolf, and it was probably maybe after dinner drinks. Okay, it was probably about ten thirty. Okay, but I came out and I drove past the new Gia's, and Frank was in there working. Himself. I mean, he was actually in there, you know. And it's just like the hometown feel and the hometown people and the hometown labor. Um, it's just it's it's the best. So we uh, that's why we like yeah. doing this to support right. the hometown, exactly. Exactly. You know, home, hometown um, people. That's what we're all about. And we we're have all, the best. We're homies. Food. We're homies. We have the best food in town, I think, or anywhere. And it shows. You know, <laughs> we're, I'm working on my one not pack. Not showing mine. I'm not no, going to no. show any oh, of mine no. here. <laughs> yeah, this isn't Kelly Pickler or uh, what's what Carrie was it? Underwood. Carrie Underwood. Yeah, close I do though. Get that a lot. Close, close. I need to yes get a little closer there. But so. Ralph, I wanted to talk to you. This is actually going to be your first year, your first time attending Duo, the Duo, Duo conference yes. we have coming up yeah. um, August 3rd, 2nd second and 3rd. 3rd yes. um, second's like a little preview day. We have right. some um, little conferences. You're welcome to attend to those. Right. Um, but the main conference is Thursday, August 3rd. Right. So what are you looking forward to? Well, first off, I'm getting my knee injected on August 2nd what? with Synvisc 1. It's this injection or whatever. So Everybody kick them in the knees. Kick it, the right knee. Thursday. Yes, the right <laughs> knee. That's right. That's right. Yeah. But uh, I'm looking forward to, I mean, I'm in a different industry than you guys, but I'm looking forward into trying to indirectly put the social media, put all this Facebook, Instagram, and everything else into my type of business. I'm in the investment field. So everything needs to go through my compliance, through lawyers and all that stuff. But I'm just looking to more so to try to expand that way and just see what, you know, I, I Dennis asked me if I wanted to speak to, you know, some people oh, and stuff yeah. when I, you know, but I'll do it next year. Yeah. Get a feel I'm, for it. Yeah, because I'm dieting now, and I'll just look better <laughs> next year. And Is that uh, Frank, what we all say? yeah, Frank and Lynn are helping me diet over here. And I'm, I'm going to show you something real quick. Really I'm like, I'm like eight. Oh, I just hit my shirt, but that's okay. I'm like ADHD, but that's okay. Um, this is the food that is they brought spread? out for us. Two people. Two people. <laughs> and Frank definitely knew, and Lynn definitely knew I was coming. Yeah. But I got shot oh, by no. meatballs. That's okay. <laughs> that's I, it's better than on good. the chest. Wait, yeah, it's better on the chest. Wait, let me see. Wait. That's good stuff. <laughs> I like it. Look Yeah, that's it. Yeah. What the heck? Are you gonna, yeah, that's right. Yeah. What are you going to do? Yeah. Well, yeah, we're, we're real excited. Valley Digital, we're really excited um, to be a sponsor this year um, for Duo Live. Um, so Dennis. Yeah, he's Dennis, missing out. He's joining Birthday us. Birthday boy. 
Yeah. Happy birthday, yeah. Dennis. Yeah, he's joining us actually, watching, um, watching us. Maybe he's going to go get a haircut for his birthday. Yeah, you know, he has Should a lot get of a hair. discount. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe a little Because shine. it's his birthday. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you for it. Thank you. Thank you. Limited hair. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. We love you, Dennis. We love you, Dennis. Yeah, thanks for letting us take this over. I know oh, I was... Oh, perfect. We're perfect. I've been... Uh, he, he knows the recipe for sauce. Getting sauce out of you. Yeah. Here, huh? Soda um, water. Soda water. Just, there you go. Let's okay, watch go ahead. Ralph clean his thing. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> oh, that's exciting. Um, I we, forget what I was talking about now. We're talking oh, about the I was, show. Well, I was excited to do this with you. Because, Ralph, you have a huge social media following um, just for yourself. And you've kind of branded that so tell us a little bit about that well i don't know i i my i joke around and i say i i really don't like drugs and i won't go see a psychologist or psychiatrist <laughs> so this is like my option. outlet this yeah. is my option yeah. yeah this is my option no you know it's really my <laughs> i was the class clown when i was younger believe it or not i was the one that would never shut up in class and mm -hmm. got detention i was that type of person this just helps with that and i just <laughs> you know i just like promoting people yeah. from our area i like promoting local people i like promoting things and you know like that i just like I, it's a great media and mm -hmm. it, you know matter of fact you know talking a little bit i'm not giving stock advice at all or anything like that let me just but um you know the the, the world in which we live facebook record earnings today it's up ten dollars a share highest ever you know price jeff bezos just became the richest man and jeff bezos is the one that owns amazon or uh, is the ceo of amazon yes, right richest man in the world right now right so this is here to stay and i just thought my my mom's on here my mom's Aww, 82 years old and she sells stuff on ebay <laughs> yeah so this is where we're going so i Everybody's try to i just try to help and it's a it's free mm -hmm. it's a great way to advertise like for instance we're talking here at gia's yeah they don't have to, not saying anything about regular advertising, but this is getting out a blast to mm -hmm. all people. Yeah. So, you know, and that's a, that it people all, share it and people yeah. don't share it. And it's yeah. just, you know, it's, it's, it's nice, you know, so. You use it all differently. But. My sister said a true PR guy. <laughs> You're walking Puerto the Rican? line. Puerto Rican no, guy? No, no. Oh, public relations. <laughs> okay, shell, love you. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. But it, it's fun. In the bottom it line, it's fun. It's fun. Yeah. So it's fun. tell us. Tell us how you spun off from just being Ralph Dejak. What are you known well, no, to what, everybody? Well, see, town? we just put on there Marcy right there, a friend of mine. This was a, 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 a sister of a friend of mine, Dwayne Bow, but Marcy Biddle. Uh, she said, stay sassy. The thing is this. It's like, you know, in anything, you have to have, like, you know, Madonna. She has one name. Prince, he had one name. You have to have a, a little bit of a catch. So I started to stay sassy Y-Town and basically... You know, I started it about eh, about a year ago or so, and it was really basically easy, easy yeah. how I did it. I was watching the weatherman. So he goes, stay classy San Diego. Uh, so yeah. I'm like, I've been to San Diego. It doesn't have anything on Youngstown. Well, a little <laughs> bit. But uh, so. Not the food. Not the food. Yeah. yeah. Or the girls. Beautiful <laughs> girls. <laughs> Ladies. <laughs> and Lynn over there. Woo. <laughs> I feel happy today. <laughs> Food and women. <laughs> Food and women. <laughs> yeah, and water. <laughs> but anyhow, but so it was just uh, it was it was a thing that I did, and I saw that they said stay. Or Will Ferrell said stay classy, San Diego. Mm -hmm. And I'm thinking, well, why can't we have something like that in Youngstown? I love this town. I moved away when I was young, or when I graduated college, but I moved back. I love I love Youngstown. Awesome. So I said, I'm going to put a stay sassy exactly. white town. How do we stay and sassy? I, you have. Hang with me. Is it a lifestyle? No, it's a, it's a lifestyle. <laughs> Hang with me. No, it, basically it's just an attitude. I just, you know, I, everybody has mood swings. Everybody has issues. Everybody, you know, deaths or births or everything. But you just yeah. have to try to balance that. And I just always try to always put positivity in my mind and my, you know, and I get, you know, believe me, I get depressed, you know, at times or whatever, sad or whatever. Mm -hmm. But I tend to bounce back real quick because... That smiley face I put yeah. on there with the yellow. I you mean, have it's that whole community behind the, it now. The whole community behind it, I yeah. hope. And you know that cheesy smile when I go like this. <laughs> At the you end, know, it's cheesy. Yeah. yeah, it's cheesy, but I, it's fun. Listen, I watch it's fun. Those videos. Hey, I figure I like if a them. purple dinosaur can make it out there dancing <laughs> Barney, the hell? Okay. Why can't I make yeah. stay sassy and yeah. come out? And, and that's actually how I. And first, it's happy. That's how I first knew you. Ooh, I, right. I. You know, I satisfied you. Yeah, yeah. I followed him all over social media and never, never <laughs> met him in person. And I was like, "Hey, stay sassy." 
<laughs> See, and that's what that's I'm saying. What it's just, I said to him. It's that's, that's it's what I it's, him. it's just a, it's just a night. I'm, you know, it's like Madonna. Mm -hmm. It's like you know Prince. Rock. It's like stay sexy. <laughs> that's not what awesome. It is. Yeah. Um, well, let's get to this food and oh my our gosh. wonderful sponsors. Um, mm -hmm. Let's do the announcement first. Um, we are going to announce the winner of the um, Valley Digital Services sponsored an Instagram post. Um, to give away a fifty dollar gift card and a Chevy Cruze. No. <laughs> oh no, I, that's I, you. Oh yeah, I can't. <laughs> that I can't was your fit. Part. I can't fit in a Cruze. A, yeah. Maybe really? in the no, I can't. Well, I'm too big. It, yeah, it is. Yeah, like Shaq part. when he gets into that <laughs> Bu Buick Regal or whatever. There ain't no way no, in hell he was in that. he's in that car. Yeah, no. No. <laughs> that's the magic of food. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Um, but a fifty dollar gift card to Gia's and Gia Angela's as they're going to be rebranding oh, here. Right. Um, most of you probably already like their page. Um, Right. on Facebook, G. Angela. So you've seen the new logo, you've seen the name change. Um, so the winner, we thank everybody who liked that post, um, who you know engaged with our post. Um, and the winner is Kim's Confections. Um, is that a person or a... That's actually a business. Oh. But there's a person behind it. Oh, so that's a it. cool name. That's a person. <laughs> there's a person behind it. I'm Ralph name. Gymnasium. <laughs> yeah. We can call you whatever okay, you Okay, right, right. Good, good. <laughs> um, but Kim, um, I will contact you directly after this live. Um, and we'll set up when you can um, come and get that gift card. But we really appreciate it. It is a small business helping another small business, local right. businesses. So and then we need we the address so we that. can send her a 1099. Yeah, no, so she can write it off. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Claim it. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Yeah, so we're going to turn to the food now, and then we're going to bring in um, Lynn and Frank. Yeah. And they're going to talk a little bit about um, how they do this, why it's so important to them. Um, how? Uh, let me just. Go ahead. How would you like to be their kids? Oh, I would love it. Well, I'm just saying. Oh, I, I would love it. The food all the time. Yeah, yeah. They have nothing but, they're going to be like restaurant owners for sure. They're in the business. The family, <laughs> yeah. Lynn and Frank, their parents, and they're, they, were, they were in the business. Yeah. Now the kids are in the business. It's going to be unbelievable. Yeah. So I just, just gonna I'm just going to try to bribe them now so I can get discounts. <laughs> have their 2033. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you get a meal like this, it's like, you know, mm, there we go. Oh, you yeah, know, it's right? all, the, all the nutrients and everything. Yeah. It's all Who knows genetically engineered. Yeah. yeah, right. But no, they're great, Three great years. family. And, uh, you know, both are great, great, yeah. great people. But uh, so here we'll we, bring in Len and Frank. Yeah. Do you we'll want to show the food about, again a little bit? Yeah, or we'll have, we'll have them go over the food and stuff. Some of the food here we have. Do you guys like my shirt? Shameless plug. I don't know what it is. Come on in. <laughs> Come on in, guys. We'll go here. Like, here we go. Prof is doing his own live over here too. Own so live. we have uh, multiple live streams Len going on and Frank. here. Hello. 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 All right. There they are. All right. So. So we could walk probably us, walk us through some of this yeah. food here. Actually, we'll start over here. Yeah, we'll start this right here. This over here is our one of our award-winning pizzas. It's called the Frank's favorite, pretty much because it was my favorite. It's our Briar Hill with some hot peppers, Ooh. our marinated yeah. hot peppers and oil, red and green peppers, some sausage, and some full world pepperoni. And, that crust. and it's a little you bit see the crust is like thicker. Oh. Right? It looks. It's, it looks like more like a good. pan, yeah. Yeah, like a pan pizza. It looks fantastic. It does look fantastic. And then the next we have the holy moly stromboli. That thing Ooh, is huge. No, that pretty much speaks for itself. <laughs> that is going to be my name. Yes. Holy moly stromboli. <laughs> Forget stay sassy. <laughs> That pretty much has huge. every huge. last thing in it that you can think of. I mean, it's all the meats, the vegetables, all wrapped up in everything you need. Together oh, and baked to perfection. Yes. And then over there we have some entrees. Uh, you know, of course the traditional spaghetti and meatballs mm. over there. This one has a little bit of shirt on it. <laughs> That's the meatball right there that gave you know, me that, the drive that got by. Sassified. Got sassified. Yeah, oh, I like that. It got sassified. Good. And we have our greens, people. I mean, that's one of the crowd favorites. Sauteed in olive oil with uh, finished with a little bit of feta cheese. Marilyn Sheets said, one of my favorite places to eat Aww. is Legend Marilyn. She's a, she's a great you. friend Thank and you. great friend and great person. And then the one up top, West 224, got a spicy pink sauce. This is one Some of my faves. Let me just tell you. Hot peppers, I love this. panko chicken. Is that chicken, chicken there? Broccoli. Yeah, panko coated chicken. <gasps> <laughs> It's good. <laughs> <laughs> and then we do the Italian style breaded bone-in chicken. Those are two-piece breasts with some JoJo's. Awesome too. And then of course the bocce balls for an appetizer. Mm. 
No comments. No comments. <laughs> we, just got done playing. we just got done playing bocce last night at the Lake Club. How'd you guys do? We won two and lost one. They had, they had three players and we had 16. But no, <laughs> we, we did okay. It's, it's a very non competitive I mean, it's competitive, but it's not ridiculous. I should have had these bocce balls before. <laughs> and then the penne Mediterranean with some uh, tomatoes, roasted red peppers, baby spinach. It's sauteed in a olive oil, tossed with penne pasta. That's awesome. And then we're featuring a white asparagus for a side. That looks so huh. good. We've been doing that for the last couple of weeks. It's never knew asparagus, asparagus from was from the green. Right. Yeah. It's actually it grown. Any it's a little sweeter, not as bitter as uh, as the green. It's grown underground as opposed to above the ground where the sun mm. makes chlorophyll or turns it in the forest. I'm passionate about my food. There you go. <laughs> Hence why this is we where have we're great stuff. And I don't want to say what I was saying about asparagus, but you know the rumor <laughs> and stuff, you know, it really, you know, asparagus makes, yeah, pee kind of weird, not to be gross, <laughs> but I thought maybe with the white one it might be okay, I don't know. But anyhow, this is beautiful. Sweeter. A little sweeter. And then there's some drinks here, which is, we're not going to have any, they're not alcohol, so I just want to make sure that I don't, uh, nobody says, oh my God, you're drinking, I'm not drinking, it's not alcohol. And uh, they're great, great, great drinks. We haven't touched them. We haven't touched them. No. Nope. No alcohol in them, anyhow. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> a little sangria, some set the raspberry. That's the strawberry <laughs> mojito, and then a Lynn's favorite martini. Ooh. <laughs> is it really your favorite? It really is. What's in there? That is um, vodka, orange juice. And oh, we needed Kristen in on this oh. one. She's our drink special. That's okay. <laughs> Uh, it is good. Somebody said the food looks great. Do you deliver to Myrtle Beach? I wish. We will. It costs $197 to deliver, and it won't be warm. And uh, I'll tell you my little Amazon story in a little bit, but maybe we can get it through UPS or something like that. But awesome. Okay. Right. So tell us a little bit about yeah. the new place, you know, guys, and what, you know, the, you know, I saw you there the other day working in there. I, you were in, it was probably 10, 10, 30 or so. Oh, yeah. So and I, yeah. And I was in the winter. overnight. She was stopped in. Yeah. <laughs> no. I didn't want to start pounding nails or doing whatever, you know. I'm not a labor <laughs> put him guy. Nowhere. I would have put Look at these nowhere. hands. These hands are soft. They're sassy hands. No, anyhow. Well, tell us a little bit about the place, right, that's yeah. coming up and what you guys are planning and, you know, any new changes in there, but, you know, what, what, you, what you're thinking. Yeah. Well, I think um, right off the bat, our biggest change that we did here was uh, we changed our name. Yes. Um, as everyone knows, we are Gia's, uh, named after our daughter, who is now nine years old. Oh and they're running around here. So they are. They're, <laughs> they're eating. Family, yeah. family, yes. Um, and then along came Angelo about four years later. And I think almost from the beginning after we yeah. had Angelo, it kind of uh, bothered Frank that, you know, it was only named after our first. And um, so he started thinking about changing the name and we said he said doesn't Giangelo's sound like a great little Italian restaurant yeah. yes so um, we kicked around the idea of maybe just doing it here um, through the years after Angela was born but it just didn't make sense um, marketing wise and all that so now that we're making the move uh, down the street we thought that it was a perfect time to kind of rebrand a little bit and um, just to include both of the kids so yeah. new name is Giangelo's um, we're just a week or so away. We're moving down to 1315 Boardman Canfield Road. And that's over there, right? If you guys know, it's over there by One Hot Cookie, same plaza, and over by where the Blue Wolf is, a plaza over. And it's the old, um, where Chad Anthony's was before, you know, he went up the hill. But, um, you know, but that's where it's at. That's the, the exact place is where it's at. Yes. And we're so happy you guys are going to have more room for all of us. Yeah. Like I said, you know, I yeah. have um, probably a family of 10 whenever we go out to eat. And, uh, and then Andrew's we need family, a big, he has about yeah. 97. <laughs> so we have He's a ton of people. looking at those cumulus people. clouds yeah. all the time. We have a ton of people that we, you know, need to accommodate in there. So it's good that we're going to have more space to be able to get in because we Yeah, we have we space. We'll yeah. have the big patio, a bigger dining room. We're going to have a private room that will seat about 30. That's good for like bigger right. woods or yeah, you know, lots of parties options. or stuff like that. And do you deliver? Will you deliver then yes. also? Yes, we are. We're still going to keep delivery. We're not going to change anything on our menu. Still the same food. Uh, we're going to be able to add a few more entrees and a few more things that 
we wanted to, to do here, but we were right. just limited with this small kitchen. And that's one of the biggest, the best things I see down there is the bigger kitchen. Mm -hmm. We'll be able to do more off-premise catering. We'll be able to do more catering. Expand your footprint a little bit. Right. Yeah. And then all the business is up there. So, you, you know, don't forget about Gia Angelo's because they do deliver and uh, they'll deliver uh, to your to your place of business. And uh, and you get all this great food, so don't forget that. And they're you know a little bit better located, I think, mm -hmm. up there, a little easier in it, easier out access, you know, which is not bad here. But you know what I'm saying, you can't make a left here sometimes. It gets no, a little. Yeah, scary. you could actually right. take that all the way through and get out on tip. Right. So we don't exactly get to a light. Right. Exactly. Now this building won't be vacant either. This is going to be where uh, coaches are going. You see? I keep hearing. Uh, right. Is it I leak it out? I don't know. Uh, we don't know. Secrets, I don't know. Secrets. I don't know. No. <laughs> I don't know. They're saying new location. I'm just putting two and two together. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Possibly. Sorry. Don't sue me, anybody. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Possibly. Who knows? Yeah. Might be. Might become a spa. Who knows? <laughs> Anyhow, but uh, put my foot in my mouth. Those 14s tasted real good. <laughs> put a little sauce on them, Frank. So I put that foot in my mouth. <laughs> Anyhow, but yeah, that's it. That's uh, like I said, this is uh, this is happening. This is going to be happening in a couple weeks. Uh, and you guys hopefully. are keeping all the same, Cooking, the same menu. Yeah. Same, yeah. same menu, same menu, same, same food, same, same friendly faces food. you always see when you come in yeah. here. Yes, absolutely. Same people you always know. Right. We are we're not changing who we are. You know, we we love who we are. We're not changing who we are. We just needed more space to accommodate um, our loyal customers yeah. and loyal guests. Uh, so that is awesome. Everybody's not on top of each other. It's yeah. better for the employees. Our staff, yeah. our team does such a great job. Right. In this little place, I, I always say it, it's a tribute to the our team here and the people we have in the kitchen that put out the amount of food that we do in this tiny little space. Yeah. It really is something. Well, and the quality. I, it's always I, I good. I can't wait for yeah. to, to get into that kitchen and that bigger space. And That's awesome. That's awesome. Frank, you do Take a lot work. of the cooking, huh? <laughs> bit, He's our bit. menu guy. I've heard kitchen yeah. probably about yeah. 50 times, so that's well, really important. Well, there's some passion yeah. about it. This was, you know, a lot of blood, sweat, and tears coming up with all these things. And How long have you guys been here at this location? Eight years. Eight years. Wow. So it's definitely, you need the space. Growing then other locations you know? too, right? In the Austin town? Yeah, we have another one in Austin right. town. That yep. is just, and that's going to stay Gia's. Um, that's just a carry out and delivery okay. place over there. So, and it's still, we pretty much do almost the, all the same food we do here, other than some of the saute and the seafood and, and the steaks out of there. But all the pastas and the appetizers, we still do out of that location. Also. So Gia still gets to keep her name on the restaurant. Are we getting an Angelo's? Or does he have to stay with the combined? <laughs> yeah. 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 You never know. Never know. Yeah. Never we have know. a dish. We have a dish called uh, I was chicken say, or yeah, the chicken Angelo. I was gonna say Angelo's Ooh. name appears a little bit more on the menu. Balance it out. Balance it out. That's for sure. That's funny. Yeah. I know. Having siblings, you gotta keep it equal, right? Yeah. <laughs> well, I wish uh, we had some smell vision on these. Oh my gosh! Yeah. Lives here because it's, it's unbelievable. Fantastic. Fantastic. Absolutely Ralph, fantastic, yes. What's your favorite dish when you come here? Bocce balls. Yeah. And the white asparagus. Yeah, I know. I like those. No, I like that the chicken. Like, what is that? The cook? What is panko? Panko. I love yeah, that. Yeah, that's right one of there. my favorites. And actually, and, I just this the, past weekend tried the pizza. I was telling Lynn, I tried the pizza. It's fantastic. Oh yeah. Fantastic. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, it's everything. Everything they do. I like the chicken. Um, I, I'm a chicken guy. I like chicken. Yeah. You can tell. Yeah. Well, I, I, know, I uh, my husband and I recently went plant-based, but there's still options here for us to eat, you know, like this Mediterranean pasta, because we don't do meat now. But this Why? Oh, well, it's just a choice. Health choice. <laughs> he still does. I do, I do some seafood. Okay, that's good. Yeah, I do okay, some seafood, yeah, but yeah. there's options for everybody. Well, you know, we I don't. Balloon, yeah. Balloon, yeah. Salmon, tuna. Right. Added. I don't feel like I'm deprived at all coming to this restaurant because what, you have options. What would bologna be? Because I like bologna. <laughs> yeah, bologna is not oh, non-compliant. Oh, okay, no, yeah. That's uh, toes and noses. Yeah. yeah. Toes and noses. Oh, oh, I know. Yeah. That's my mom used to say Italian steak sandwich would be the fried bologna. Yeah. My, yeah, my, my grandma, we, we called her Gam. That was her 
For, we always yeah. had bologna. Always, she was always frying up bologna right. in the kitchen. And when she would come here, she had to have her fried bologna sandwich with the hot peppers. So you use her cheese. recipe? Mm -hmm. Exactly. See, we love that. Yeah. That's what we have here that, that we can offer. Both your grand, both yeah, grand both, yeah. Oh, Grandma geez. Grandma Tootsie, I make her. She called them cubbies, but they're pretty much like a knocky. And uh, so we run those on special called Grandma Tootsie's cubbies. Aww. Gams, crouton soup. I love that. I love the nicknames. That's why I love White Tom. Me too. Stay yeah. sassy, White Tom, because Gammy, uh -huh. Tootsie. Yeah. yeah. I mean, you know, every, yeah. I like it. It's I all like in it. there. It's yeah. the best. Yeah. But that's that's what we have, guys. Yeah. Get so. down here, and um, we're not selling these to you. These are ours. <laughs> so we got uh, I got two meatballs here. I got half a chicken. I'm gonna have. I'm gonna get back at this guy for getting my shirt. I'm gonna take some of these here in that holy moly stromboli. And Ralph doesn't leave anything for me. <laughs> <laughs> Ronnie feels too when we go out. Yeah, Ronnie's like, but Ronnie eats more than me. I'm gonna get Ronnie. I love her dearly, my fiance, but she eats more than me, and I think she weighs as much as my leg. Yeah. Yeah. I don't she's know beautiful. where she puts it. Yeah. She's beautiful. Oh, she's a beautiful person in and out. So once again, um, the winner um, of the gift card from Gia's G Angelos um, is Kim's Confection. So like I said, I'll be reaching out. Um, you'll hear from me personally directly. Um, I'll get in touch with you and we'll organize everything to get your gift card. Ralph? I think we should start eating. Yeah, thanks for joining should, me here yeah, today. Yeah, well, a funny story. You know, we, I, I wanted to just say this real quick. It's a little bit, I, I have like, a, I just have random thoughts sometimes. But anyhow, I was just telling him earlier, you know, we're talking about the social media and we're talking about, I'm going to put this right here. We're talking about social media. We're talking about, you know, the, the change of, you know, the change of the, you know, what's going on. I ordered my, I ordered some stuff from my office from Amazon. Oh, yeah. So it's two-day delivery. gets delivered today. I pick it up. It weighs about 40 pounds. I'm like, wait a minute. I got four creamers and hand soap. And I'm like, what the heck is this? Anyhow, I open it up. I got 40 pounds of rice in there, 32 pounds of beans, all this stuff. I have somebody else's order at my office. And Amazon <laughs> said they let mess up less than 1% of the time. I might play the lottery today. I may play the lottery today. It might might be my day. Well, you'll get it organized. Yes, and yes. Send to the right person. We'll get Without the no chips. That I'm taking the chips. He's going to keep the chips. <laughs> and the rice aronis. Yeah, 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 and the rice aronis. <laughs> He's going to keep all of that. It's a San Francisco treat. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so, again, thanks everybody for tuning in. Tuning in to Duyo, tuning in to Ralph. However, you watched us, thank you so much. Um, we really appreciate everybody here. Um, letting sassy. us coming in, letting us come in, um, Lynn and Frank. Thank you. Thanks, 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 guys. Thanks we appreciate it so much. Come down for lunch. Support local business. Come to Gia's, Gio Angelo's down there when they open up over there. Just support local business because it's us, it's Y Town, and that's what we're about. We support each other. Absolutely. All right. We're not paying for this.